Welcome back everyone. The time right now is 5:11, and we're taking you on a zip trip to Spartanburg this morning. Really excited about that. 7 News' Christine Scarpelli is joining us live right now. Good morning, hey Christine. Guys. How you feeling? Yes. <laughs> Good morning. I love Spartanburg. This is so much fun. And you know, this is perfect timing because there's a lot going on right here in town. If you're in Georgia, you're watching from North Carolina. Spartanburg is really sort of a gateway, especially maybe from the Cherokee area. Come on down and do so in the next couple weeks, couple months. There's a lot going on. Kenneth Cribb, though, you're going to recognize him because he's literally everywhere. On every corner, there's something you have your hands in. It's something good, too. A lot of food and a lot of music. Let's talk first about some of the restaurants options we have when we come to Spartanburg for you. Sure. Well, our um, main baby is uh, Willie Taco. Yes. Uh, it's a really fresh chef driven Mexican fusion concept. We have three locations now. Okay, where? Uh, we have, uh, of course, Hub City starting Spartanburg. back in 2013. Yeah. Uh, then we opened in Greenville nice. at the uh, historic Feed and Seed. Yep. Uh, Boiling Springs last October we opened. Yes, they and we've got one in Easley coming and as well later this year. You, you did a lot of research, I remember, with Willie Taco. Before they opened, I mean, you really looked everywhere for authentic flavors, right? Yeah, our team, um, five of us uh, essentially traveled all over the Southeast, uh, gleaning inspiration from all kinds of different um, restaurants, independent restaurants, and yeah. um, from A to Z. And it was just a really good um, learning experience. And then we formulated our own concept based uh, on our own ideas and what we had learned out on the road. And really good cocktails. Sorry, Abs those oh, are my yeah. favorite Fre part Fresh margaritas, <laughs> absolutely. It's yes. important. <laughs> okay, what else? What else can we eat? Okay, so um, after we did Willy Taco, mm -hmm. we decided to open this 14,000 square foot uh, beer garden and restaurant called Freight Yard it. and it's built out of shipping containers. Um, we have a stage for live music. We have a 20-foot jumbotron. Uh, it's dog friendly and kid friendly and the star of that menu is our house ground sausage. It's awesome. You can go on Facebook guys and look at it. It's really impressive at Freight Yard. It's right on Main Street. There's something else happening right downtown. That's right. The, the most fun uh, downtown event uh, and the most high energy downtown event of, of the year is the Criterium. Yes. And we really missed that last year. Yeah. Um, it's back August 20th and we're right in the epicenter of it. So, huge cycling huge. event, and racing around Spartanburg and Freight Yard's right there. So that's if you right. don't have a 10th, they're all sold out. You don't have a place to watch. We go to Freight Yard. Come right? on in. We've got 16 uh, taps. We've got a really awesome chef driven elevated street food menu. Nice. We're going to be streaming the Jumbotron, excuse me, streaming the race you on can the watch Jumbotron. It there. Literally, you'll see racers go by on Main Street and Broad Street. They're circling us. Yes. Um, and it's just a fun a place to just pass the time. Plus, it'll be the ultimate after party. We'll have three live bands going until about midnight. Singing, dancing, and screaming. You got to cheer for those racers on the Criterium, guys. Kenneth Cribb, thank you so very much, guys. We'll send it back to you. Much more to come this morning from Ooh, Spartanburg. Sounds like a little bit for everyone. Thanks so much, Christine. And Spartanburg is just one of our many zip trips. Seven News is visiting different cities all over our area. Our next stop is Fountain Inn. Next Friday, we're going to take a closer look at what makes that town so special. It begins with Carolina Morning from 5 to 7 a.m. on 7 News, and then from 7 to 9 a.m. on the CW. Then the fun continues from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. on your Carolina. Find out more about future Zip Trips. Just click on Zip Trips under the News tab on WSPA.com.